Hi, in this video we are talking about one of the two important organic acids in toxicology that is oxalic acid poisoning. Oxalic acid is a corrosive acid. It is crystalline and resembles magnesium sulfate and zinc sulfate in its characteristics, though they both can be differentiated. The characteristics and severity of the injuries caused by oxalic acid depend on two things, the amount and the concentration of the acid swallowed. Now the effects of oxalic acid poisoning mainly fall into one of the two categories. One effect can be local, and the other can be systemic or remote effect. The local effects include corrosion of the GIT, mucosa or skin, which is very rare. There is sour taste in the mouth. No trickling is observed as it is a weak acid compared to the mineral acids. The vomiting is continuous and the vomitus contains coffee ground material due to formation of acid hematin. The abdomen is tender and purging, purging and tenesmus is observed. Now the systemic effects can be one of three things, shock which leads to collapse, hypocalcemia, the hypocalcemia occurs because the serum calcium reacts with oxalate forming calcium oxalate thus depleting serum calcium. This results in tetany like symptoms, numbness, tingling and spasmodic, spasmodic twitching of muscles of the face and extremities. Thirdly, it is also nephrotoxic. That means it causes oliguria and albumin, blood and calcium oxalate is present in urine. The oxalic acid crystals can be seen as in the shape of envelopes under the microscope. Now the fatal dose and fatal period. The fatal dose of oxalic acid is about 15 to 20 grams. And the fatal period is about 1 hour or maximum 5 days. Now in case of acute oxalic acid poisoning, the treatment includes stomach wash. Because the degree of corrosion is less than that of mineral acids. A soft, soft stomach tube is passed and lime water can be used for gastric lavage. Warm water is not used because it dissolves more acid. An antidote such as any calcium preparation such as chalk which converts calcium into calcium oxalate can be used. Alkalis are not used because their oxalates are soluble. Kidney damage is also assessed but rest is symptomatic treatment. In case of death due to oxalic acid poisoning the post-mortem appearances include if increased concentration is of acid is used, same as mineral acids, except lips and chin do not show staining. The mucous membrane is white or red, white when it is bleached and red when it, it is irritated. Acid hematin is formed, which, which causes stomach contents to be dark brown gelatinous liquid. Perforation is rare. The submucosa of stomach has dark lines due to bed vessels and the outer coat of stomach is inflamed. If there is delayed poisoning and the person seems to survive, there is congestion of lungs, liver, kidneys and brain. Inflammation of small intestine in kidney is also observed. The medical legal aspects include not used for suicide, not used for homicide but can be used in forgery to erase writing. That's all. Thank you.